Kane Miller Fulcher to Tony Creates and guys our altered book project now I'm gonna leave the cover to last because knowing me I'll probably get it full of glue and stuff so we're gonna leave that to last I have made all my tabs with this tab three inch didn't realize it was so big when I bought it <clears throat> uh, from the book and there was an auto autograph section messages and whatever so I just went and made a whole bunch and here's a tag I can use oh wait that side I can use but this side I can use because I need this is okay let's let's we'll work this out now it's all part of I will put the link to the video series that I'm watching inspired by Kylie at Kylie's Card Crafts. Okay, so let me just show you what happened. So I prepped the first page. Well, this isn't the first page. This is the first page, but I haven't decided what I want to do there. So I have this wee one. And then I did the, the cover for what we're making today. Nah. And then I made another one. Nah. Didn't like it. So now I have to find another page. So I haven't glued the pages in. I've prepped them already, guys, but I haven't glued them in. Um, so what I, my plan is to have a flippy floppy page, writing page. So this is writing, flippy floppy page. Okay. So we're going to put this one on this page. We'll see. I think we might have to cover the birdie. And there's pink. We'll have to decide. We'll have to decide, but I think we're going to lose the birdie. So I thought I'd quickly show you how I glue on a piece of paper. So this this is practically a glue glue book. So what I do is, first of all, I need to get the corners and the edges are the most important that you have to be thorough with okay and then I just go like that whoops don't glue your page down the whole idea is not to glue the page down and then I just move my page along okay let's get the other stuff out the way and I just make sure I'm not putting on top of another glued section which of course now because I'm on camera that's happening anyway so I have been prepping this project guys I thought I'm gonna do this project we're gonna film it it's gonna be 20 minutes so you don't have to see me doing now that my edges are all glued I can just come and I can I can glue this and with these marvelous lights it's easy to see where the glue is so you don't actually miss a spot and I like to get no shiny bits so if you just go like that the, the, the edges of that stroke are not really glued but if you come like this it is slathered with glue okay so let's just get him down there Get a little bit more come you can come and be oh, more colby sagas i don't know guys he got hold of my wool again i've got another pile of wool to untangle i swear this dog has a wool fetish it is just and then of course he goes and lies with his with a toy that he can play with and it's like i uh, sent a text to my family and told them that the the wool demon had struck again and then I'll put the picture up of five minutes later what he was looking like so who can be cross with that I ask you but I'm telling you I'm like getting fed up with this dog so let's just now they might be might have to come and trim afterwards but that is an afterwards thing actually I'm not down here need to get to the bottom of, oh and I haven't inked 
so I'm just gonna lift that up because this needs to come down there we go and this is obviously just quickly want to glue that I've just uh, ink that I've got my uh, ink brush I'm just gonna go in there it's got this um, sepia antique antique sepia and just just give it a, a squish there might have to come and put some washi tape on here because like this page looks like it's too short and I, all my pages are exactly the same size because I made a template guys I just took one of the actually it's nice having it a little bit short because you can get into the when I took one of the pages and just all I did was trim off the end because you don't want it going right into the middle and it looks fine I might just have to trim a little bit off the top but that's okay we'll come do that later once that glue is dried and all I do is just take my cutting board and I'll put it under there and just cut with a knife because it's much easier very really difficult trying to get a scissors in there maybe your ambidextrous and can do all this. so that page is prepped now I won't do the other side because we don't need to not for now I'll have to come trim off this edge uh, but that we can do at a later date there we go all done let me show you my template I just took a page guys uh, like that and and then used it to cut out the pages so at least my height is right I'm just gonna put that in there so remember for when I do that one okay so now we have to do this so I should have also stuck these other pages in but we don't have time maybe I should do that quickly I'm just thinking guys trying to smooth these pages down this side down when this is all lumpy bumpy might be a bit difficult okay I won't stick it in the book we'll finish the project but we won't stick it in the book okay so I used this Tim Holtz die cut and I um, I I cut out but so it's the largest and then the next largest but I made sure that when I cut out let's turn this down the next way so that when I cut out I put this one right up against this one and then I got the scars a frame all right I got the frame but it's it's brought on one side these two in here I might as well I'll keep one I might use it oh it's two I might use it for something later on so and that, that's what I did and then I went like this and so instead of cutting a straight line I just did a, a zigzag so it doesn't it doesn't look like like it's just been chopped off there so we got this guys okay so I have one here already inked then I went and I found I actually don't have an example for you well I found this with the journaling cards and I've cut these journaling cards down to size so I had this okay um, these are unfortunately all bent so I didn't keep them I could have I suppose if I'd used hot water I might have been able to get it to relax but anyway so then all I did was I took this okay took this and I, let's just get a pen lost my other pen that I was using it's here somewhere somewhere anyway and then uh, okay this was the edge because there's holes down here so I just went that's coming off so I just went like this I want this on the top move it in a little bit okay move this up so that it's at the top I'll move this down so it looks like this frame is this now these because this paper's got a will of its own just kind of trying to make it look like it's straight okay so I know for a fact this is gonna fit on here so I need to get the paper to do what I wanted to do so I'm gonna go like that I'm chopping down that side and then I'm gonna go like that okay then I just got my cutter oh there's my pen 
Okay, just got my cutter, my chopper. Now, you can use any form of acetate. It doesn't have to be a... But I had this, I was lying, I was actually looking for my index cards. I had a whole pack of them. This was something I gutted it out of a, a, a book that I wasn't going to use anymore. But do you think I could find it for the life of me? But I found these little odd bits stuck in a box. I was like, okay, we'll use you. Uh, this is the side that's straight. So, yeah, so, anyway, it is what it is. Now, I need, I need a, a white piece of paper so I can actually see what's going on here and so that you can also see and look like the, there's a little bit of something on here, something, something, oh, we'll take it off. what that is glue probably it's always glue it's always glue glue on the fingers glue on the clothes okay so we take our non ink side we get our glue let's take our bits of paper out the way here so we don't look so scruffy okay and then we just come put the glue down don't want to get too close to the edge and it's a bit difficult with this squiggly squiggly edge you kind of like okay now get on the top because that was something I was getting to do okay let's put the glue back now get this down you can stay down there. Get this down. Here we on. Let's just go like this. I don't know why this is curling. Okay, let's go from this side. Whoops. We want that and there, and then we bring this down, which is now completely wrong, but we know this fits because we measured it. Just move that up to the top, move it in. Move this one in. Okay, now there's glue all over the show. Okay. Flip this round. Let's just make sure the side is clean. Well, here's the dry one. Okay. all squished down okay let's look that up let's find a, a non gluey spot you can see how this one's kind of bent a bit get that one straight clean off that glue clean off the glue at the bottom that's one thing with the acetate you can you can get that glue off quite if once if it's wet it comes off like a charm so there's our piece okay I'm not going to give you measurements guys because frankly mine's different because I've got a long long journal I'm doing I'm not doing like a standard size then I got my piece of paper okay which I have cut slightly bigger okay slightly bigger than what I want and that looks good so now we can just stick that down okay
one getting right to the edges so the journal cards I've made have just been the the size of the frame they're not they can't be bigger than the frame then so okay let's get a fingers one looks like he's a bit skew. It's okay. It's okay. So now I kind of know that that's more or less what I'm. I'm just guesstimating the edges, guys. Oh, and making my acetate go to the the top. Okay, that's it. There we go. So I have now made four of these okay now we take our tabs okay and this is this is what we do so this is is my right side okay so I've inked all my right side ones okay so we take the wrong side and we just get our glue. Oopsie, does that need to be that's a spare? In case my calculations are this this is wrong side, yeah. Wrong side. Whoops. Come on now. We were working five seconds ago. So we're off to the daughter's orientation. So we're taking her because she's not not that confident driving on the M50 which is our like main highway which is always mad guys and always used huge trucks and so she's not really confident driving on that and her little car probably have a heart attack if it had to drive on a highway and actually go 120 kilometers an hour or 100 I think the M50 is 100 okay and then you take out now remember these are the wrongs Am I doing this right? No, I'm doing this wrong. No, I'm doing this right. Just my brain had a little bit of a ee, put the brakes on, put the brakes on. This is not making sense to me. No, we're sticking the wrong sides together, guys. So next one. So let's just do this. So this was just like a birthday, he had a big birthday party with this guy, what's his name, I've forgotten his name, um, and this, I think this was just like people writing in the birthday book, so I thought just to honour honor the book, who's this guy, actor, I don't know, what's his name, John Mills, John Mills. Uh, he um, who did he act with like like the oldies the old guy old guys yeah the ancient guys um, people like uh, Jimmy Stewart he's got a picture with Jimmy Stewart um, he's got who did he Humphrey Bogart, I think, was one of the people he, he's got a picture with. Um, just want to make sure that's, no, that's slipping and sliding. This paper is shiny, guys, so we're going to have to give it a, a minute to... So we've got one, one. Come on, did you not... Two this one why aren't you sticking to three yeah one two three okay let's let's just tell it who's boss let's tell him now I was gonna put some of these down on my I think they're all on my I did put some down on my desk Ok, 
Come on, can you please stick straight? Okay, next last one. Here we go. Yeah, so I thought just, just honoring the book and putting something in the book. So I've just made all the tabs in this book are going to be with this, these bits of da David Nevin. He worked with him. So, see, now I'm getting confused. There we go. So, we're going like that, getting you down like that, so that we are all together. Right, okay, so remember you glue the wrong side, the side you don't want. Mine aren't double sided, so let's just get some of this glue off here from my fingers. There's a spare one. Okay, so they're all done. Okay, I'm just going to give them a minute to dry, guys. But not glue together. So we are done okay come just these two glue together here one two three yes we've got two glued together here come here cheek of you come on it's just that edge okay let's give that a minute to um, do her fate so, right, so these are our four that are going to go on attach there. But now we need something to put, I'm just going to go like this. That's going to go in there. Those are going to go in there. And I'm going to be covering these guys with this. I'm going to take some of these out and cover them with it's a standing joke between me and the recipient so she'll get the context of coloring in pages in a journal um, so that that I will do off camera so that those are going to go in there so now we need the container where did I put it where did I put it yeah they are let's pack these away while we we're waffling here yeah. just so we can get those out the way and this is how I store my die cuts I because uh, sometimes it's difficult to see in these packages what's actually in there so it's just I just leave it pack it back in here so I can not like that the other way around so I can actually see <laughs> okay right so we need to put those in with that and then uh, okay so that we're not doing that that we're not doing we're on this page and just okay so actually we don't need this yet right so this is a thing this is a full 12 by 12 i went and got my um my Stamperia, what I call, I have a book box called unused. It is no used, sorry, used. So this is like the scraps to the tiniest one that I haven't used that I stick in this box. So I went and looked and I got a couple. This is like an oriental one, so but this one had the least sort of paper and you want one side at least to be non-directional, guys. So this is the, the right side up but this side is it is kind of directional but not you know what I mean so now I need to decide which one I want to do I think this one is probably more Anna Anna like so let me just uh, let me just do uh, there they are that 
okay so we're doing so I think I'm gonna put this one on and maybe we leave the little birdie there I don't think I'm gonna put a pocket behind because we have got this but I see this is not straight so we need to take that in there like that and get our bone folder and just go like that that's better okay um, you see I folded there so I kind of need something over there to just strengthen it um, this side is like that okay now guys I went and got a lot of witchcraft do you do stuff uh, more more shall I say but I think what might be nice is oh look at that this was this piece is actually a wee bit long in the new in the new I think I'm gonna put that on there okay so it's got the greens and everything so I'm gonna put that on there to strengthen our uh, what you might call it okay I want to round these corners okay and I'm gonna use the big one there we go okay then uh, we want I'm gonna put a bit of lace on but I'm gonna stick this right on the top like I'm not doing it in the middle I'm just sticking it there so we've got a bit of lace um, what color uh, green I've separated all my laces from greens and what what but we want a nice um not on board enough too flowery oh my goodness i'm gonna have to go buy more lace actually this would be good hmm Let me get this. This is actually elastic, but you know what? Once it's stuck down, it doesn't know it's an elastic anymore. Hold on a sec. Okay, let's uh, let's glue this. Let's. Uh, I want to take this. Looks like it's got a bit of a skew edge here. Okay, I'll pop it over the edge there. Okay, let's just glue it. Okay gonna glue and uh, let's move this out the way shall we mm -hmm. we all's having a heart attack there oh. you know I'm getting totally fed up with this glue I need to do something something about it I need to change the nozzle this is just plain old tacky glue Oh, I wanted to ink too late. Never mind. Okay. Okay. So where's my fold line? There it is. So I'm just going just over the top like that. Let's get the, the non stick scissors. Get and like that. Stick that down somewhere. Okay, now while that glue is, is busy there, I'm just gonna tell that to lie down. Okay, so that's got himself good and solid. 
and then I'm gonna take the screen and I'm gonna go like that just need another element I don't know don't know what to put a word or something but we we don't know I don't have time guys um got another five minutes and then I'm going off to somewhere and I'm going to Wicklow for a walk while we're waiting for it to finish uh, we're going out for dinner because her thing it's a weird time it's like from it's at the it's at the it's at the ambassador's house. Yeah. The Japanese ambassador's house. She's doing her orientation. And uh, so, but it's, you know, it's one of those distances where you're coming back, back home is just, no, let's do something. Especially us old folkies that are set in our ways. Okay. This I'm going to, I'm going to, um, Well, we'll ha it'll have to be the next video right so we're going to put these down so where's our cards where's our cards hmm? what have I done with them here they are right where I put them right so which one do we want in front which one do we want in front um, let's go like that okay now Here's what I'm gonna do. So the first one. So you don't this flap and this flap you don't glue, guys, because that's gonna attach to your what you might call it. So we're gonna so this is gonna be our first one, okay? Now let me yeah. So we need to let's go like this. We need to let's I think no. Come on, glue. You need to work. This this is my fastest drying glue. So, and I've had the pin out here. And what happened? Yeah. Don't put the pin back, girl. Then you can't find it. See, there's something going on there. Something's going on there. Okay. So, let's go. Put the glue down. We need to. Um, hmm, I think I've put too much on there. Just gonna. And then it's gonna go on the front. Now I just kind of want to look and see where the middle is. So, so you only need to do this for the first one. Once you've got one down, you're all right. So we've got three and three here because it's six. Uh, pencil pencil so there's the middle of that okay so then we go in the middle of this don't push it too far down guys and that looks more or less more or less is good enough guys it really is okay so we got that one down, right? Flip over. Next one. Okay, now all I have to do is line up my cards much easier. There we go, lined up. Okay, let's just open that one. He's good. Make sure there's no glue lying around. Open this one. Sort out the glue. Don't close it. Okay, so. Next one. Put that down. And glue dripping out now. 
twist it doesn't want to come out and now it's just flowing okay so we go like that so we have to leave now whoopsie there just line up my cards and there we go next one Always come back and do repairs, guys. And the last one. Okay, oh, look what I did. Okay, so there we go. All four of them. Make sure we we have everything cleaned up. Don't want to be sticking stuff down, which happens. Next one, all good. Next one, all good. And next one, glue leaking. Okay, so now this is going to, so this is a 12 length. I did the top two and a half, changed it, and then the bottom, I'm not giving you measurements, guys. I just took the width of my card. Okay. This one, this one I actually, I think I chopped, no, I chopped it off the top. Um, oh, didn't take into account of the, I'd already uh, done this one beforehand but basically you want the width of the width or the height to be the height of your card okay and then making sure that this bit comes down okay so now before are we are this this doesn't get glued down so now we're going to glue these in and that's not is that the one i got in the front now that's not the one i wanted in the front uh, anyway it's now the one in the front now we are going to glue these two to either side okay uh, what I'm going to do is just put a little bit of glue down here and these give it a little bit of extra jammy jammy okay okay and then glue here okay and glue here so the only thing you really need to remember is that you glue in the wrong side of your tags because you want the right side to be showing don't go and do that woman put it in this way so now I'm just looking for the middle oh and I did put a little hinge on there guys so let's uh, let's find the hinge find the center and we're gonna go down there down there we're gonna close everything and push it like we want it then I'm gonna open this side is it in there is it in there just push that pushing my cards and pushing this down we want that glue to stick guys okay let's give that a minute you see what I think I'm getting gunky here and then what happens is every time I push this in it gets gunked up so anyway look get that out hopefully this won't gunk up my I need to try I need to put one of these on I have one I need to put it on I can just put it on the top of that okay so what happens now when you open it i, I want to be gentle here is it'll actually flip open like a index card there we go okay now these i'm going to i'm not going to do it now guys i'm going to take these i'm going to stick my book page on and then i'm going to stick a tab on 
and I'll step my tabs okay and that one there and then the next one there that's one that's folded and then the next one like that okay so that's what I'm gonna do with that um, we will next video guys don't have time now I literally have to I mean this this video might seem short to you but I've been up since six o'clock doing this now the family wants to leave so next week next video will, will be a really short one I will show you how to put the closure on this we're going to put a closure and what we might do is a little bit of decorating okay folks